Hey, this is Team Hudson's again with Libby, Chris, and Brian talking more about cruise questions for the new cruiser. Last time we talked about embarkation day, what kind of documents to have. So today we're looking at what you actually do on a cruise, like the sea day, things like that. So, uh, Libby, things you do on a sea day for us, well, first day on the ship, as you get on, right before you cruise out, you have the mustard grill. Mm. That's where you go listen to the safety. Uh, presentation they give to you about how to put on your life fast. That's about the most boring part of the cruise. Everybody has to get in their little muster stations. Safety first. Yep, safety first. Don't try to skip out on it because they will find you and they'll make you eat cream cheese and make you feel awful and you'll mess up for about this cruise. Go and get in, go to it, suffer for 20 minutes and get out. It's only 20 minutes. It's only 20 minutes, people. Come yeah, on, it's man. It's not that bad. Come on, man. <laughs> come, on, come on, man. It's less than have to watch Beyonce or, oh, hey, gosh. it's much less than Tim Rusher on Meet to the Press. There you Chuck go. Chuck Connors or whatever his name is. But really, yeah, people, you out. go ahead and go to the mustard grill. Then you're going to go out the first night, go to the main dining room if you like. Get some food, pizza. Get some food. The main dining room has you get served. We like to do a sign dining now. After we had one to try to with it. We like it now. You go in and have your table. It don't really matter. Just walk in. Our table is 360 on a fence. Okay? Mm -hmm. Just walk in, get on sit your table. Your, your wait staff, after the first night, will have an idea of what you want to drink. Lord help me want to try to throw up my drink because I, I go all around between teas <laughs> and whatever. Because, you know, if everybody knows what you're drinking, it can poison it easier. Okay, mm -hmm. just think about that. Okay, uh, but you got your appetizers, you got shrimp cocktails. What's your favorite thing to eat on the cruise? Ooh. Uh, oh, darn. Uh, I like the stuffed mushroom appetizers. Oh, that sounds good. Yeah. And okay. remember, you can get more than one up appetizer. What's your favorite, Chris? Uh, of appetizers, it's got to be that uh, shrimp cocktail. Shrimp cocktail, Chris that loves really that. Good. Dessert, though, I'd have to be, I had to go with my favorite multi lava cake. Yeah, hot. What, is what is that? Oh, okay. uh, wait, you see, it's uh, mm. that's another the video we gotta make. in the middle. Uh, it's real good. Serve it with ice cream. I also, ask for peanut butter while you get it, too. Have like a peanut butter with it. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Other things on Sea Day Brunch It's probably my favorite event. Because you get up in the morning from uh, 9 o'clock till noon, they have Sea Day Brunch mm. where you can <laughs> go in and get my favorite filet mignon and eggs. Okay. Mm -hmm. so that that. sounds really good. I don't care much for the scrambled eggs. I'm going to get them once over, anything like that. I don't like the scrambled eggs because they don't use real eggs. But if you ask for them turned over, they got to. Okay. And the filet mignon is excellent. Uh, also, an appetizer for brunch. Is appetizers the, for brunch? Yeah, they have starters. Mm -hmm. The flaming tomato soup is awesome. I love that. Okay. Uh, let's see, Chris, what's your favorite? Uh, just for uh, city brunch. brunch. Yes, I like some pancakes and he bacon. Likes chocolate covered pancakes and a mound of bacon they bring. They bring a lot of bacon. Yeah, bacon. Because bacon. it's like they're serving it while it's going out of style. Yeah. <laughs> now one thing, another thing you get is yeah, eggs sorry. Benedict. That's good. Yeah, that's, that's why I fell in love with eggs Benedict. That's actually out on Lido deck. Mm -hmm. So for breakfast, if you don't want to get all gussied up, you want to save your jammies. It's got to the Lido deck, or you can, not before you can put in an order for room service for a continental breakfast for you. Okay, so think about that too while you're ready. Okay, uh, so they got a couple options, or you can always go get pizza for breakfast if you want. <laughs> that would be me. That, that, would, be me too. that would be me. Okay? <laughs> Eating pizza is, for breakfast is allowed on a carnival cruise. <laughs> that would so be the both of us. Yeah. The rest of the day on a sea day, bro. A uh, sea day. Enjoy yourself. Watch swimming. The, watch the ocean. Hit the pool. Hit the water slides. Be a kid again. I want. Okay? I, I love water slides. Water uh, slides but, are play fun. bingo. Hit the casinos. Anything you want to do. Do some shopping. Casino. Press a casino. Okay. So do some of that. That's always fun. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what that, about Chris's favorite? The comedy club. Oh yeah. Yeah. Comedy always. club is Chris's favorite. He usually hits about every show. They usually have one that's PG. And then they have the late show, which is adults only. Got to warn you, when they say adults only, that's what they mean adults only. They use the love uh, 
They tend to use the F word in a lot of them, so if you're not a fan of that, just go to the PG store uh, show and go do something else. There's plenty of clubs out there to go to, mm -hmm. or just anything else. Just human watching. That's what I love to do. Uh, and just chill out. You're at sea. You're not at work. So enjoy that day. Okay. So that that crunch cover sea day. When you, well, one more thing. When you get back to the room and your supper's worn off, pick up the room service guy. Order room service. There's a lot of items you can get on room service in, from Rubens, other sandwiches. I say myself. Go ahead. Wings. Of now, course. Uh, hold on. Now, wings, all way you can get wings on the carnival ships right now is through room service, and they are $6 to order. So yeah. Pay for that. But, guys, you want some wings. You know you this want wings. This guy loves wings. This I don't know if you guys knew that. Wing. Yeah. Okay? But they are $6. I did try one of them off the boys' plate in the last cruise. They are pretty good wings. Are and they hot good wings or like? You can get different flavors. Oh, you can get different flavors. Buffalo. Okay. But uh, or six dollars. Some of the things you can get for free. But remember the tip the guys at least a dollar per tray. Okay? So that covers the sea days. Yeah. If you got any questions about sea days, let us know. And also typically your first sea day will be your elegant night. And elegant nights in the dining room where you dress up a little bit. Come on guys, you know you want to. Put on part of dress pants, that dress up. Throw you a towel. Come on, people. Just dress up for one night. Get a picture taken and you have some fun with it. As soon as you get out, you can go get rid of the monkey suit and put your uh, shorts back on or your jammies, okay? Or your jeans like me and t-shirt and like your Packer this. hat because I'll be watching a Green Bay game probably on Sunday night. Oh, that's right. You're only watching and the Packers tonight because it's Super Bowl night. I went huh. there. I, went I was there. talking about November. Well, the Seahawks ain't going to be in the Super Bowl tonight either. So. No, they're not. But and let, she, well, she adopted my Packers. Anyway, yeah. adopted. Okay. So that's when in the sea days. Them? So tomorrow we'll talk about excursions. We'll see you on the next video. So again, this is Libby, Chris, and Brian, Team Hutchins. Have, and have a good day. If you like our videos, just subscribe. Have a good day.